Hello, Pitbits here. Welcome to the grid, Paul Ricard, for another race through the Trollovision League with the PC. Uh, I've qualified seventh. I've got relatively good pace. I won't be winning, I don't think, but hopefully to put in a good um, a good performance. The race time is very different to the qualifying time. So qualifying was done at 2 p.m. I think, and race time is 6 p.m. Um, so we could have some issues with tyre pressures and temperatures. I've put the pressures up. I don't know if I've done enough or too much, so we'll find out. And I don't know what others have done, so that'll be a bit of a, um, a fly in the works if that doesn't work out. But need to get the tyres warm, and I'll join you when we get back round to the start. Okay. Nerves are kicking in. We're getting round to the start. Tyres are okay, I think. I had a spin during the warm-up lap, but uh, managed to recover. Uh, so not the end of the world. Um, I'm on the inside for the first turn. so um, And then the outside for the second turn. So we'll see how that goes. I'll, I'll try and uh, avoid any incidents on the first lap. Because uh, it's an hour-long race. Uh, no pit stops. So I'm going to run these tyres all the way through. I don't know what others will be doing. So I've got a full tank of fuel, 110 litres I started with. I've got 107 now. So uh, the car's going to be a bit heavy. I did do some practice with full tanks, so at least I know what it feels like. But here we go. Go, go, go. Watch your right side. Hold your line. Still there. Still there. On the right. Still there. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Still there. Still there. Clear on the right side. Okay, well we defended that quite well I think, for now anyway. Problem is we've got the long straight coming up now so anyone near behind will get a massive slipstream and we're a little bit too far away from those ahead. So we'll see. Yeah, I think we're going to get done on the straight but oh well, those are the brakes. See how brave they are into that first corner on the first lap, won't we? I have to say, I'm not very brave, but you know. I made a bit of time up there, I think, which is good. And these two look like they're fighting a little bit. Which only helps the guy behind, generally. Okay, let's settle into it then. Sixth place. Gosh, the guy behind had a good run there. Much better than me. Again, not quite close enough to the guy in front, and I've got somebody right behind me, so that's not good. I think they're going to go by if they've got the speed. Oh, 
Well, they may not. Well, they may be quicker in the infield because they've got more wing on. Because they're not going by. Yeah, this is a hard corner, and people are struggling with it by the looks of it. Watch your right. Right side is clear. Left side. Clear left. Oh, we're in a race, aren't we? Gosh, he's got a good run on the right again. Hold your line. Hold your line. We are clear on the right. A lot of defending going on here. I'm not going to give these positions up lightly. Brakes are getting hot. I closed the um, I closed the vents because I wanted to keep the tyres hot. And there's this long, long straight where they. Um, where they cool down. My tyre pressures are really high, so I'm thinking I might have gone the wrong way with uh, tyre right. pressures here. I mean, they're coming down on this straight, but they need to be closer to 27, not 29. So that's a bit of a worry. Right side's clear. The car's still drivable, so I'm going to keep going. And hope the temperatures come down. Whether they will or not, I don't know. New fastest lap for Hill, 156. P6. It's got a better run again. to 2.6 yeah they might be behind me on the straight again which is not good I don't know if he's got the speed this guy in the Audi the tyres are coming down in pressure which is good And I think we're quicker in a straight line than this Audi. I think he's set himself up for the infield. Oh, we've overcooked that. Right side. Now I have practiced this. So I only lost one space because I've practiced. I've practiced going off there, if you like. So I know what I can do with that um, outfield. So that's not too bad. And tires are still hanging in with me, although they're not. They're certainly not what I need. They're oh, they're really hindering me. But late in the race, who knows? Now I need to hang on to this Audi, particularly on that straight bit, and I think I could get back by. So it's how quickly can I uh, reel him in? It 
but certainly in a race. on your exits. I think he's got away, he's got so much more speed in the infield. But we know I'm quicker on the straight, but I don't think I'm going to reel in a second and a half, even though it is a two kilometre straight. He's got no slipstream, but I don't think we're going to catch. better. So I think what I want to do is just keep reasonably in sight of them and we'll see how the race goes because my tyres, they're not getting any hotter which is good. I mean obviously they're not in the ideal window but it may be that others are and they won't be later on so I just need to keep going, not lose too many places. And I'm back where I started, so that's not too bad. Probably need to break a bit earlier because I'm carrying too much speed in and then losing it on the way out. Right behind me now. Hold your nerve, just keep it smooth, no mistakes. wide again I know I can cut back down when at some point he will get frustrated and I'm sure he'll make a, an ill-advised lunge but in the meantime, all I can do is do my best. Seventh position. Yeah, I've really not got the line through there. Porsche behind us, are they quick? In front is increasing. It's now I'm not sure how quick they are. He's got past that Aston Martin, but he's not quicker on the straight, is he? Not quick enough, anyway.
Oh, that's the problem with Paul Ricard. I couldn't see where the track was. <laughs> My mistake. Well, that's annoying, but okay. Let's get back out there. Green flag, all clear. The yeah, I got completely confused road. by the um, by the blue lines. Completely lost my bearings there. Never mind. Let's get back on it. Let's hope these tyres recover at some point. I'm back where I started, P7. Tyres are getting a bit better. Certainly not getting worse, anyway. A few people have been into the pits. I'm not going into the pits, I'm just going to run to the end. So the guy behind is catching me. Well, probably a second a lap. And I'm catching the guy in front, probably half a second a lap. So I don't know what's going to happen, but towards the end of the race, we could all be together. I'm hoping uh, at car 808 Hill, I'm hoping his tyres will, he's beating the pit, so he's got good tyres. I'm hoping they'll sort of go off a little bit and he won't catch quite so quickly. Oh, she's closing very fast now. I've got no chance here. How far is he? Saying 2.6 seconds. God, he's nearly on me. And he's bringing people with him by the looks of it. That's not good news. Fifteen minutes left. That's fifteen minutes. Come on, man. Keep pushing. I'm trying, Jim. I think I'm a sitting duck here. The gap in front is now 11 seconds. Yeah, I think this is it. This lap or the next lap. Depends how quickly he wants to get by. The gap to Hill behind is now 0.8. He's not going to go away, Jim. He's going to get by in a minute. I 
There's no point flashing, Sunny. We are racing. Not a back marker. Watch out on your left. Your left side is clear. Nice right little side. drift. Oh come on. There's no need for that, the was there? Station clear on the right. Incident clear, green flag. Bit of patience, Mr. Hill. The next car is Hill. So, not the best result. I haven't quite finished, but hopefully going to come in ninth. The tyres just never, never came to me. Um, so the tracks never really got cold enough for the pressures I put. I should have left it as it was for qualifying, but last week I ended up with tyres that were too cold. So this week I thought I'll be clever. What I'm going to have to do is uh, practice at this time of day on the test server. Um, during the week. Last week it ran the race at 6pm and we all thought that was a mistake but it's done it again this week so I think we're going to have to assume it's going to do it every week. So I don't want to be caught out. That's two weeks in a row now where I've ended up with the wrong tyre pressures. So uh, that's really held me back unfortunately. I was doing late 55s in practice. Um, so this is not not a great result but it's done. We finished. Somebody's got a plus second, plus 30 second penalty by the looks of it. Uh, so I don't know what they did. Uh, but yeah, that's the end of the race. Thanks very much for sticking with me. Um, ninth at the end. Um, too far behind Mr. Rose, I think, to uh, make up for that 30 second penalty. Um, hope you enjoyed that. And I'll see you next time at the track. Just a quick update, they've just updated the results and I did benefit from uh, Mr Rose having a 30 second penalty, so 8th overall. Anyway, see you next time at the track.